As you fade away As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby, have a taste All the Wow It's been at least one year since I was building models Or is it maybe one and a half years? I don't know It's been a long while I think the last thing I did on the channel that I completed was this submarine. I don't know if you can see it, but I still have it here on my desk. And uh, there's a lot of dust here, so I better clean up this mess. So, <sighs> plenty of dust. So, I really want to give this a try again. And uh, I have a lot of models in my stack. But I haven't got time, I haven't got the motivation, it's been Corona all over the world, it's been plenty of stuff to deal with. So now it's maybe time to start up this channel for real again and see what I can manage. I don't know if my airbrush is still working, but I have it here. Super cool airbrush. We will find out. So, I was going to build something with science fiction. Machine and Krieger. I have never built something like this. And this is how the box looks like. It's quite an amazing big box. Uh, I will try to change my video so I won't do the unboxing now. I will start building the thing and you will see the end result in the beginning of the video and I will continue to work with the model and uh, I will also show off the model in the end of the video so I'm glad you subscribe to my channel I'm really happy and if you're new to the channel please subscribe hit the bell icon down in the corner I appreciate it's for free uh, this kit from Hasegawa it's a really really fantastic kit uh, you don't have to clean up any details at all. There's no flush, there's no nothing. So just cut up the pieces and glue them together. Also this kit is quite advanced. There's a lot of joints that you can move. For example to positioning the legs on the model. Uh, so you have to be really careful when gluing everything together so that, so that you don't get any glue in the wrong places. And uh, in this sequence I'm building the legs and as you can see I'm putting in a nylon joint there or nylon bushing and uh, there are many many parts but it's really really fun to build this model because everything fits so amazing good. Uh, I'm not sure how easy it is to get hands on this model but I found my model on eBay and I ordered it directly from a guy in Japan. But if you're into sci-fi, uh, then you should really look into the, those models from uh, Hasegawa, Machine and Krieg, and they are really, really fantastic. Maybe on the upper side uh, when it comes to the cost, but you get a really, really good value for the money. And as you can see here, here is the feet uh, all put together, and there's no moving joints there. And here you can see the complete leg with the upper and the lower parts that you can move freely.
<laughs> Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby have a taste All the highs and the lows, no you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you but I can't control the pain and as you can see here, the thruster, or what you should call it, it's got all, also some uh, nice moving details. I really hope that you will choose to stay through all the pain. I know you told your friend you're not okay. So now it's time to complete the body of the model. And uh, there are quite many parts, and it, it's a quite big model, as you can see. Uh, but everything fits so nice and you don't need to sand anything, you don't have to fill in any gaps, everything just falls into place. This bottom bar you see now I'm gluing, uh, I think I broke it three times, so be careful with that part. You should maybe uh, save it for later and add it to the model in the end, because I don't see why you should mount it from the beginning. So I, I broke it three times, but things happen and you learn always something. Every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me I'm There are three paint sheens uh, within this model uh, but I went another direction because I saw some really nice pictures on Flickr of a guy who had painted and built one of these models. So I followed his pictures and tried to copy that. So I think with science fiction you can do whatever you feel for. So here I've painted all the interior details with like an army green. And uh, there are a lot of small things to be hand painted, as you can see. 
it's really hard to record when I'm hand painting because I'm using a magnifier so this is just to show you so here we have the parts and you, as you can see I have shipped them very hard uh, I'm using a sponge and a regular pencil for that and uh, they look really really worn and uh, there are some brass details and tubing and things like that or what you should call it and it looks really really nice uh, until you put the pilot in because then he is hiding all the details so that's a pity uh, I should have maybe left him out of the complete build because pilots is so hard to paint I think I think the worst thing you can ever paint and here the bodies get primed and I'm using uh, Mr. Surface I think it's the great 1000 here. So camouflage is now done, two colors, uh, dark grey and black camo and it's and here we have the thruster with, painted with Alclad chrome, really superior paint to use when you want to do something that looks like metal. And here we have the gas tank, I guess it is, and you can see it's heavily shipped. Uh, I was using shipping fluid on that part and even the deflector uh, behind the thruster. And otherwise I'm just using sponges and uh, pencils for the shipping. And uh, the gas cylinder, I guess it is, on the top here, I'm using putty that I have diluted with the thinner so that uh, I want to have some structures on it and uh, now I've painted it with brass so it looks like it's got a reflective cover over it. And uh, here you can see me do the shipping with a sponge. I first did the shipping with a pencil and then with a sponge. But I did way too much, so I had to redo this step. Things you learn. And here I'm applying the first wash, very gently on different places. 
you can see me doing that and uh, it's a tedious work and it never ends it's a uh, I guess it's more than one or two days just for the uh, weathering At this stage I have put on all the decals. The decals were top quality as well as the kit and uh, all the weathering is almost done. I did some uh, more weathering when the complete model was done but this is how it looks so far. Time for some clear coat and I'm using Tamiya XF86. It's a flat uh, lacquer or varnish or whatever you want to call it. Uh, it gets a really really nice finish on the model. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change. In my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way to win it life. I never miss that. Well, this is the step before the last weathering and it's now time to reveal this a little poppy. And I hope you will like the new video and here we have the end result. They wanna say my name, but they holding back They wanna say they hate, but they know it's cap I ain't play no games, I just do that's fact And I don't feel no shame, it's a mood you lack I go crazy, nah, but I ain't lazy Track after track, I work on this shit daily Pass me the jack, right, this fuel got me hazy About to unpack all these shit I've been chasing I've got visions in my head Like memories after death To be a legend instead Of something you can forget I'm living up every breath I'd rather read than be led I'll fill the seats as I spread with every word that I've said. <laughs>